guys, how's it going? T R X Hawks here, back with you. Uh, and today we have got a um, like a the biggest games of the weekend, basically uh, on my big, biggest games of the week on my football. Um, so yeah, sorry if I keep on looking that way. Sorry if my eyes keep on looking like weird. It's because that my I can't see myself when I'm looking at the camera because the camera's over over there, as you can see. Um, but yeah, so. If it's not if it's not welcome back to my channel, uh, remember to subscribe and leave a like, and turn the notifications on um, so you get notified when I upload any of my videos. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm really getting back into the swing of YouTube now. Uh, I know I really the past two weeks I really haven't been uploading much. Probably uploaded like four videos in the last two weeks. Um, the reason for that is because of my internet really. I'd be able to. I'd be able to upload any game videos. Oh. But yeah. Um. So yeah. Let's get straight into it. Sorry. Um. So as you can see, we're in a new background now. Um. If you want me to lower the iPad, I will definitely do that for you guys. Um. Kind of. It might be a bit too high. You might not be able to see my face. And so yeah. Um. But let's get straight, straight, straight into it, shall we? Um, so QPR vs Huddersfield is the first match of um, Championship. A big game actually because the reason is um, QPR vs Huddersfield have loads of scouts there actually really. Uh, I remember this is my football. It's, some of the players that I mentioned are not even that good really in real life. But in my football they're absolute gods really. Um, but yeah. So um, for QPR wise Jake Ball and the silver have been linked to Southampton to play with Jay Ward, Powers in the middle because that's really where they're lacking at the moment in Premier League last season for my football is the midfield um, but yeah so and then uh, up front Charlie Austin has been uh, has been scouted by um, Southampton uh, and I mean Burnley I mean Burnley um, and the reason is uh, they don't have better strikers um, and Burnley wants to really come to the table in my Premier League. Um, but yeah. So, um, should be a good game. Should be a really good game. Should be a good high scoring game. Because I think that QPR are playing three back for the first time ever. So, and when Huddersfield play against a three back, there's goals galore. There'll be only be at least four goals at least. But then, obviously, QPR have uh, tries up front. But yeah. So, really, at the end of the day, I will be doing a. Um, like a match, um, like a day review, like how did what what the best games were today. Um, see, so yeah, that 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 should be one of the good games that happened today. Um, but yeah, so next was Brentford versus Preston. The next game, not really the best of games, but I want to see how well Brentford do about Ollie Watkins or Benarama. Uh, and then Mill versus Watford, not really the best. Watford got rid of game last season. Same with Norwich, who in the next game. Norwich versus Derby, uh, Norwich got relegated. Not really the best of games either. West Brom versus Luton. Um, West Brom was supposed to be in the Premier League this year, um, but because of hashtag United, I know hashtag United. Um, I always put like a meme team in there, um, but I think I'm going to stick with the hashtag United because they have quite a few good players in my Premier League in my football. Um, but yeah, so West Brom couldn't play, so they got re they got demoted, they got relegated. Really, they got relegated down to the Championship, uh, and they played Luton in the first match day. Barnsley versus Swansea, not really the best of games, but I want to see how well Barnsley do with their youngsters. Because uh, last year they did, they did really well with their youngsters. So I want to see how well they do this season. Um, but yeah, so next up is Carver versus Coventry, not the best of games. Then Blackburn versus Bournemouth. Um, Bournemouth, they could lose all their players if they, if they don't get promoted this season. If they don't get promoted this season, they lose all their players. And they have really good players. Uh, I can name a few. So they have um, Solanke. Um, Philip Billing, um, I think Steve Cook might be going. I think Glavin Birch might be going to Bournemouth. Um, they have Harry Wilson left wing, who's one of the future talents, and is meant to be, and he's linked to um, a big club next season. But if they if Bournemouth get promoted, he will be going to he will be staying at Bournemouth. Uh, and the right wing they have Glenn and Vales. Um, but yeah, so big big game. Blackburn have some good players as well. The next is a derby. Sheffield United versus Sheffield Wednesday should be playing tomorrow. Uh, same with Sheffield United. Um, 
they got relegated last season. And um, yeah, so they last season they got they got ninth place in the Premier League and they did quite well. Um, but yeah, so um, and then uh, that's a big derby, obviously, big big derby. And then the last three games not really the best. So yeah, moving on to the next season now, La Liga. Um, La Liga doesn't have the best of games. Um, the only good game really is Celta Vigo versus Atletico Madrid. Um, the reason is Atletico Madrid finished third last season. Celta Vigo finished fifth. Um, but the other game I don't have it written down here but it's Seville versus Real Madrid um, should be a very good game because uh, Seville have lost Jules Kunde to uh, Newcastle United I know Newcastle United are, oh we sound great to lose but actually Newcastle United are really tight, are tight favourites because they have some of the best players ever they have Noah uh, 16 years old and is looking really good um, actually played against uh, Liverpool's team last season he did when he's 15 years old, and he absolutely cracked them. Um, but yeah, so then that, uh, that's it there. Um, so yeah, Jul I want to see how well Jules could, how well Seville do about Jules, couldn't they? But still have Diego Carlos and other players. Um, but yeah, so I want to see how well they do. And then Bundesliga, not really the best of type weeks for this league as well. Only Wolfsburg and Sch versus Schalke and Bremen versus Leipzig are the only big games. So Dortmund are playing Union Berlin and Bayern Munich are playing Freiburg. So I expect for Dortmund and Bayern Munich to win both of their first games. Um, but yeah, that's really it for the game then, guys. A very short video for you guys. But I want to spend this next one minute or two minutes to speak to you about uh, the videos for today and the upcoming videos. Um, so yeah, so today there will be a match review of the two games last night, um, a match preview of the two Champions League games tonight on what I think the uh, lineups will be. Uh, I'll do a reaction video to the lineups, um, but I won't do the I won't do a reaction to the lineups. I mean, tomorrow there'll be a Spurs show uh, where I preview the um, where I preview basically um, like I don't know what I was gonna say then. Where I just preview the game and also do some other top news because I've 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 got a lot of big news for you guys this week um, because. It's been a big week for Spurs, like transfer news wise, uh, players leaving, and yeah. So, and then also tomorrow we'll be doing what games to watch in the Europa League, and then the fr and Friday we'll be doing um, a like um, what games to watch this weekend in Premier League and other leagues as well, like Bundesliga and the Liga and Liga. Um, but yeah, so also my, my football wise, so my league basically, my football. Uh, I will be doing um, a video basically explaining what it is because I know I don't want to explain it every single every single video that is different to real life football. Um, some players like Ronaldo is at Liverpool, probably is at Tottenham, uh, are not the same players at what they are at their club right now. Um, but yeah, so also be doing a team of the week one announcement for my for my football. It won't be it won't be like, I won't make a game where I do them. I was meant like card concepts like I did for the top 50 um, cards and basically I'll just show you what the team of the week one will look like. Um, but yeah, so there'll probably be a few good players uh, in the Bundesliga League and Liga, but there'll be no Premier League players, which will kind of downgrade the team of the week. Um, but yeah, um, so um, that will be, I don't know if I'm going to do team of the week one next uh, Monday. I might do I might do team of the week one next Monday actually. So we have two games to see who does the best. Um and then also every single day from now we have transfer news on my football as well. So yeah that'll be for video going guys. Uh see you guys later. Remember to subscribe if you're new here and leave a like and see you guys later. Peace out and bye bye.